What Would You Do? continues. You gotta be kidding me. We gotta put a stop to this. Hey, why are you playing this game? I know, it's like so much worse than the first one. Like you would know the difference. What is that supposed to mean? It means that girls suck at video games. Here, give me that. Why don't you just go get your nails done or something? You're at a video game store where you see a gamer being harassed simply because of her gender. Do you let the bullying play on or do you step in and tell the boys, game over? What would you do? Girl gamers, they should be called girl lamers. <laughs> Trust me, we're doing you a favor. We're at the Game Exchange in Bridgeport, Connecticut, and it's game on for our bullies. You shouldn't be playing that. You're a no, girl. No, I'm serious. You shouldn't be playing that game. Girls, girls don't play video games. Those words quickly catch this shopper's attention. They play video games for girls, but not like that. Seriously. Seriously. Yeah. Absolutely. Why don't you just leave me alone? I don't even know you. Because you shouldn't it, be playing that. It's a, this is a guy's game. Girls can't play video games like this. With all due respect, why don't you leave her alone? Let her play whatever video game she wants. How about that? You know her? No. So let her play a video game, man. And now another customer joins his cause. You got something against girls? Yeah, find something better to do than pick on her. How about I'm that? I'm not picking on her. You I'm certainly just are telling her she's a girl, she can't play games. Probably kick your ass at some of these games. Why don't you just back up and let her play? I mean, maybe you should mind your own business. Yeah, mind your own business. This is your, my take business. Your own advice. This is a game that she shouldn't be playing. I would love you to leave. I don't work here, though, so I don't have the authority to tell you to leave. But I would, if I did, I would absolutely tell you to leave. Come on, let's just go. Whatever. Let's keep playing. Thank you. Time to tell them we're just sure, playing sure. too. Hi. Ah. <laughs> Fantastic. How are you? <laughs> Why is it good to stand up for a stranger? Like I'm an educator, so I, this is what I do. Uh, I see this kind of stuff, and uh, uh, I never want to see this happening. And uh, yeah, this is this is nuts. We hit the reset button. Our bullies are all charged up. Yeah, I want this back. Oh, you're I told still you, I... playing this game. Stop Here, it. Here, look. I got you some movies. Stick to that. Stick to what you're good to. Just Stay told, away from video games. just told you not to play. This woman is watching from across the store. I don't, I don't understand how you really thought you could play. Like, this is a guy's game. What are you doing? I mean, I was trying to play like, a video game. But it's her daughter who decides to stand up to our bullies. I'm a girl. I can play whatever I want. She can play whatever she wants, too. Really? You, I, you, I disagree. Do you think that girls can play video games? Like, Yeah, actually, yes. Can you, I, yes shut I up. Can. Just shut up. She can play whatever she wants. Why are you defending a stranger? Because you don't know her. she's a girl and I'm a girl. That's what she's doing. You guys are ruining the video game culture. Like, okay. seriously. Sure. Sure. What? It's, a, it's like a guy's thing to play video games. Come on, let's just go. We're out. Come on. Let's just... As the boys have leave the store, yeah, she fun. shows compassion for our girl yeah. gamer. Thank you so much. Hi there. How are you? I'm John Quinones. This is the show, What Would You Do? Oh my God. <laughs> Proud of her? Very. But I told her well. <laughs> some guys feel like it's their domain. Like my brother says that to me, like, no, you can't play this game, I can. What do you say? I keep playing it because I can do whatever I want. <laughs> Our guys continue the harassment all day long. Why are you even here? You know, video games are for guys. Why is it a guy's game? It's a war game. It's a game. If it's fun, play it. This man tries to convince them that Look, gaming isn't a boys club. I'm just trying to keep these games for us guys. There's girls out there playing. There's probably girls out there better than you. And this woman fiercely shuts down yeah. our bullies. Yeah. My son plays online, he plays with women, okay? So she can play the damn game. Shut it, because I don't want to hear it, okay? Thank you very much. You're OK, ma'am. Oh, hell no. <laughs> yes, you are. Hell it's what, no. <laughs> what would you do? No, you did <laughs> This is your daughter? Yes, she is. What is the message you want to give her about these things? That men and women can do the same thing. We're equal. We're rolling one last time. Girls don't play video games like this. Why are you doing that? James Inglis clearly doesn't like what he's hearing. But will he press play on his opinions? 
statistically, there are more female game players than there is guy game players. That may be the case, but not yeah. in games like this. Yes, this is a war Like, game. they make games for girls. If girls there can actually girl be in war, they can play real war games. <laughs> what? The, what, do you, what do you mean? Like, girls can't play video games. What? Because they suck at them. That draws in a new player from way across the store, James's mom. Do you know her? No. You don't know this girl and you talk to her? She shouldn't be playing this game. Oh man, you would have said that to me, I would have worked your out I would have you up. Straight up. You don't know that girl, you talking all that crap. But well, she, she's in a video game store playing video games exactly. that are for guys. It's Dude, a guy's mind game. your business, though. If she's playing, that's none of your business. If you don't know that girl, leave her the f alone, buy your games, and then bounce. Why, Why are you defending her? Because you she's a female, and you opened your big mouth, and you said that girls can't play games. And you're attacking her. And now Steve Gonzalez joins the team. You guys sound so ridiculous. Thank Why don't you just keep your mouth shut? And yeah, let everybody go about their business. Why y'all doing this, bro? Because I'm going to you out for being ignorant. And it's a wrap. So, shut up. We're going to have a nice day. It's a wrap for us as well. My man, how are you, brother? It's part of a show. What would you are do? Are you serious? You all right? <laughs> <laughs> Why is it important to speak up? Can't you just let nobody just talk to you like that? That's crazy. I wasn't brought up like that. A lot of people taking a lot of people's kindness for weakness. This is your mom, yeah. tough lady. <laughs> why, why you speak up? Well, one, I'm a female and I have daughters. You're not a big person. I have a big heart. What do you say to those who don't say anything, who won't speak up for someone else? Stand up. Because there'll be a day where you're the one that's getting attacked and no one's going to stand up for you. And in the end, when the players unite as one, we are all winners.